Studies have shown that dogs are typically clingier than cats, however, recent research has shown that clingy cats, or cats that suffer from separation anxiety, is a genuine concern. Cats that are overly clingy with their owners are ones that want to be petted very often, groom themselves excessively, want to be held seemingly all the time, cry out when they do not receive attention, and have the desire to groom their owners by licking them, and do not like to be left alone. A cat that is overly clingy and suffers from separation anxiety can cause the owner to be at a loss on how to fulfill their cat's needs. Suffering from separation anxiety can happen due to the following reasons. They were orphaned or abandoned. They were weaned too early. They were removed from their littermates too early. Some cats are simply clingy by nature, with some purebred cat breeds like the Siamese and the Abyssinian known for their clingy personalities. But in some cases, clinginess can be a sign that something is up with your kitty, therefore, it's important to pay attention to what might be causing this behavior. One or more of the following causes might be behind your kitty's clinginess. Boredom. Your cat might be clingy simply because they aren't getting enough mental and physical stimulation, says Bitbucket. Taking breaks to play with your cat and providing interactive toys to help keep them active and entertained throughout the day can help in these cases. Premature weaning and separation. Kittens can develop separation anxiety from being weaned too early or from being taken from their mothers and littermates before they're ready, says Catsbro. Calm. Kittens typically move from mother's milk to solid food around 8 weeks of age. But adopting them as soon as they're weaned can prevent them from learning important social skills from their mother and siblings that can set them up to be more secure and independent as adults. Insecurity. Cats are routine-oriented, and any change in their routines or environment can make them feel insecure and send them looking to you for reassurance. Big changes like moving to a new home, the addition or loss of another pet or family member, or kids going back to school after a long vacation can be enough to make your kitty need the reassurance of constant contact. Newly rescued cats may also need a lot of reassurance that they're wanted and welcome in their new home. Wanting to provide comfort. Cats are highly sensitive to human moods and emotions. It could be that your kitty senses that you're going through a difficult time and wants to be there to comfort you and make sure you're okay. Pregnant pet parent. Some cats have an uncanny ability to sense when a woman is pregnant and become extremely affectionate throughout the pregnancy, says Catsbro. Calm, exactly how a cat can tell there's a baby on the way is a mystery, but if you're expecting, don't be surprised if your kitty wants to snuggle up to your baby bump. Lack of enforced boundaries. Some clingy kitties are simply spoiled. If you pamper your kitty by giving in to all of their demands, you'll reinforce their clingy, demanding behavior by teaching them they can easily manipulate you to get what they want, says all about cats. Underlying health issues. Dementia in elderly cats and can also indicate other health problems. A neurological condition known as cerebellar hypoplasia, CH, tends to make cats exceptionally cuddly and attention-seeking, and it's usually accompanied by balance issues and lack of coordination. While it can be nice to have a highly affectionate pet, some cat parents find that overly clingy and demanding behavior is disruptive. If this is the case, you'll need to take steps to help your kitty be less clingy and more independent. And if your formerly aloof cat has suddenly begun displaying signs of clinginess, pay attention to other signs that could indicate health problems. In general, any time your cat has a sudden change in behavior, it's a good idea to consult your veterinarian. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. How to help an overly clingy cat If your kitty's clinginess becomes a cause for concern, follow these steps to help them become more independent. Identify the cause. While it might be obvious, you may need to do some detective work. Keep in mind that cats are so sensitive to change that something as seemingly minor as getting a new sofa or rearranging the furniture can cause your kitty distress. Consult your vet. If you suspect health issues might be involved, schedule a checkup with your vet. They can also help determine whether separation anxiety resulting from premature weaning is the cause and advise you on how to treat it. Set firm boundaries and enforce them. Close the bathroom door behind you. Don't give in to every demand for attention, and make your lap available on your terms, not your kitties. Schedule playtime. Provide toys to relieve boredom when you're busy or away from home. Place a perch next to a busy window for bird and people watching. If this isn't possible, search online for videos for cats, which can help keep your cat entertained while you get other things done. Consider adopting another cat. While some cats thrive on being only pets, clingy cats can benefit from having another kitty around to keep them company. 
This is especially true for cats who become clingy after the loss of another household pet. Adopting a potentially clingy cat. If you're thinking about adopting a cat, take your time choosing the right one. Carefully research any breeds you're considering so you'll know what to expect. Consider whether you have the time and energy for a highly affectionate, potentially clingy cat. If adopting from a shelter, pay multiple visits to the cat you're considering to see how they behave around you as they become more familiar with you. Cats can take a while to let their true personality shine, so the more you can get to know a cat before bringing them home, the better. And if adopting a kitten, urge the shelter staff to keep the litter with their mother until three months of age to give them time to be fully weaned and socialized by their original cat family. It's nice when your kitty is affectionate and wants to be with you, but too much of a good thing can be a problem. Taking steps to help your kitty be less clingy can help both of you be happier, and may even help your kitty be healthier in the process. Prevention of clingy. In terms of prevention, it is very important that kittens stay with their mother and littermates for as long as possible, at least eight weeks, before being adopted. The bond kittens have with their mother and each other is very strong, and gradual weaning should be done, starting around six weeks. Weaning should be a very slow process. There are ways to prevent odd behaviors exhibited by your cat in your absence. You can enrich his environment by including elevated areas, places he can hide, more toys and puzzles to occupy him, and scratching posts located throughout your home. When your cat is by himself, he may feel secure in a more comfortable environment. You may want to consider purchasing a cat tree, which is complete with carpeted areas, scratching posts, and a hideaway area. This may help him feel more at ease. Discovering ways to praise him when he is acting the way you wish for him to act will help. When he is sitting away from you, you may want to give him a few treats and praise him. Simply rewarding him for appropriate behavior may help him realize what you desire as his owner, or parent. If your cat has a severe case of separation anxiety, you may consider looking into a behavioral therapist. A therapist can come into your home, observe your cat's behavior, and give you suggestions on ways to eliminate the unwanted actions that your cat is doing. Over time, this will help enhance the relationship between you and your companion. Give affection but in moderation, only when your cat is well behaved. It is really important to gradually increase the distance. You need to ease your cat into their new independence. Change can be shocking and stressful so it's important that you take it slowly. Pay attention to your cat and their behavior. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.